Hey everyone, Brendan here from Glorious, where we set goals, hit goals, and make new ones. Today we're we'll talking about AS token. So AS token stands for Australian Safe Shepherd Token. So it's another dog-related token, and it's been getting a lot of hype lately. Uh, JaVale McGee has tweeted about it. Caleb from Barstool Sports talked about it on the podcast. And yeah, just a lot of eyes on this specific project. And it's been doing really well. So if you got an early, good job to you. And yeah, I think just because the, the ticker that it has, people have just been curious about it and learning about it. It has some, definitely some interesting um, aspects to it with rewarding, etc. And yeah, we're just going to talk about everything involved with ASS today. So uh, let's, let's just get into it. All right, let's talk about Australian Safe Shepherd. So this is the website. They have their dog on uh, driving, uh, sunglasses on. Let's go. 5% of buys reflected among holders. 5% of sales reflected among holders. 5% additional attack to create rising price for. So what does this do? It's community driven, automatic LP. They have rewards for past rewards. I think that's pretty common. 154K holders. An achievement we accomplished in only 23 days. They've gotten some great uh, press lately. Again, you know, obviously their name stands out. People want to know what it's about. Maybe some people are disappointed that they learn it's about a dog. But again, I think it's, um, you know, I think it's interesting. Caleb Presley from Barstool Sports mentioned this on his podcast. And they put this prominently on their page if you want to listen to it. They obviously uh, have legitimate white papers on here. So you can actually see. Uh, I think the joke is, is that, I don't know, you can even click on this. But we spent countless working on this. Provide clear direction on where it's going. Um, so obviously, obviously playing on to the joke, uh, JaVale McGee, who's an NBA basketball player, has talked about this and so got a lot of interest on this project. And uh, our pack leader and creator of this, Crypto Live, is uh, talked about this uh, in general. If you want to learn how to buy this, again, trust wallet, load it up with BNB, however much you want. Click on decentralized apps on the bottom navigation, the second button. Look for pancake swap. And then make sure you grab the right contract address uh, right here on the website. Make sure you're grabbing on the website. And then make sure that you, through version one, again, it's important which version, version one or two. Uh, and then set the slippage to 12% and then swap. And you should have it. Again, make sure you're grabbing the right contract address. But those are the main things about this. I think the biggest thing for me is, you know, they are, they have a pretty strong community, 34,000 people. You know, a lot of eyes on this prize. I think they've been getting a lot of good press lately. I think that's huge. They do have an NFT portion <laughs> on this. Literally, I, and I swear, this is, if you go to their, where did I, how did I get here? If you go to their uh, link tree, they, they show like everything. They show their ass NFTs and that's what you got. So obviously they're playing to that. And yeah, again, you can see everything they want. You can even grab the contract address from here. But let's check out the price. This is what we're interested in. And this is what it's at. So actually, I think I actually like looking at this. And do, 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 do. let's go to version PancakeSwap version one. Yeah, so this is where I kind of discovered this. Obviously, I'm looking for projects that are newer. This is I, I wrote about I made a video about FEG. And then actually, um, Australian Safe Shepherd was actually, you know, top six. I think it was like top five yesterday on terms of volume and activity. And so if we actually look at it right now and how it's doing, it's actually been growing pretty well over the course of, let's look at the last seven days. So obviously it started early in May and then there's been some fluctuations. It reached all-time high literally yesterday and it took a big dip. So again, looking at the end of projects early, this one might be interesting. It's been kind of like staying steady around the 0 0.000044 mark again, but their supply is relatively huge. Again, they didn't, I don't, in their website, they didn't even, there's their total supply, 10 million, billion, trillion, 10 quadrillion. So, you know, uh, obviously the growth, but obviously they, they have a ton of supply, so take it for you will. But um, yeah, I think overall, I think it's a reasonable price to get into all things considering you might want to again it did grow today so uh you know from that drop that it had but again keep your eye on it it's kind of been fluctuating i think the market has been kind of fluctuating the last couple of days but again i think the sole fact there's a lot of attention on it the ticker even though you might think it's a ridiculous ticker 
it gets eyes on this project, which is good in the long run. If you want to learn more about this project in general, you can obviously, this is not enough how safe this uh, subreddit, work safe this subreddit is, but you could just check it out and learn more uh, about this. Obviously very meme uh, loaded uh, subreddit, but I do think that this project could be interesting. Uh, I don't know if there's actually a legitimate white paper on this. To be honest, I couldn't find one. Let me, let's check the link tree one more time. Uh, nope. Uh, they do have some uh, staking and farming uh, through BSwap if you want to check that out. But um, yeah, in general, I think it's an interesting project. I think there's still very early on. I think there's a lot of things that they want. You could check out the ass NFTs in your free time if you would like. But I think the biggest thing is that, you know, they're not taking themselves too seriously. Obviously, I think a lot of people have been pushing this project and, you know, obviously do your research to find out if this project is for you. But again, just solely because of their name, I think that they're going to get people wondering about it. I think there's some good activity. I would try to monitor. I try to keep, if I go back to what, what, do, 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 what, um, I see here, I kind of monitor everything in like the top 10, top 15 to see where it's at in terms of activity. What's the, th what's the, the guidance, like how are, how much the people are buying, etc. And then obviously I check the price to see how things have been going, right? Because like, I obviously don't want to buy it at this moment when it's up 50%, but maybe in the near future, um, again, it's still early on, but in the near future, I want to see if it dips down a little bit more. But um, yeah, let me know in the comments what you think about this project, if you plan to buy it, if you own, ask yourself. And yeah, I'm going to give you guys, keep you guys updated on this. I'll probably jump in to this project sometime in the near future, but uh, thanks everyone for watching. I'll catch you guys next time.